Hello, darling. I think about doing this all the time. And since I just saw you were on Instagram, I thought, just do it. Do it now. You know she's on her phone. So here's our house. It's just a little sort of cottage, but we love it. And I have been kind of killing myself in the yard this week. I mean, I have been working too, but I was gone on a work trip the week before. So I gave myself a little bit of leeway. And um, we've come a long ways because we've turned this all, this grass all into um, not grass. And um, so I'm just gonna do the front and then later I'll do the back. Um, there's a story behind so much. I can't believe, like, I don't know how to grow trees and I can't believe that tree's growing. These will be white. All these things hopefully will be big, big, big. These are Meg's marigolds because she wants to do some dyeing. Um, Chris makes these boxes all over the place. Our neighbors call it the Olympic box. There's sunflowers coming up there. There's stuff coming up here. That tree is also a miracle. The first one died. Uh, bee balm, which we love. We have it in the back. So Chris said, can we have it in the front? And I said, sure, I guess. I mean, if it grows. Butterfly, da da da. There's the house. Um, this guy's a miracle too, Clematis. He's kind of chugging along. My sweet peas, which I love very much. And then I want to show you, Chris is working on this. I just wrapped the strawberries last night because the squirrels and the chipmunks are, they're eating all of them. So we'll see if I get any, but I'm gonna grow pumpkins in this box. And Chris took this ladder and like sawed it in half. And then he's making a thing because if I have pumpkins on the ground, the squirrels will eat them. So I saw um, our neighbors um, on my, it's a route that I go on my bike. And then I actually met them this past week. And I said, you guys gave, are the ones who gave me the idea for the, um, you know, growing pumpkins and then hanging them or whatever. These guys, and like a lot of this stuff, I mean, I've bought stuff, but I've also got stuff from neighbors, like that's from neighbors. And then I just get such a kick out of it when things grow. And this year, some things are coming up, some things are not coming up. Uh, you just sort of go with it. Corey and Betsy usually get me a Mother's Day basket, which... I can kind of sometimes fail at because you got to water them so much. This is a Christmas cactus that my mom gave me that in the summertime I just bring it out. These are all chairs, you know, you've seen that Chris made. But anyway, so that's the front. Um, I'll send you the back in a little bit. I got to finish some stuff out here. Chris is taking a break and then anyway, I always say I'm going to do it and then I never send it to you. So there it is.